I'm Paul Bennett at Shoestring Shipyard here in Millbridge, Maine. We're located along Maine's Bowl Coast, not very far from the U.S. Canadian border. I just completed two applications of polyester resin and I used an unwaxed polyester resin also known as laminating resin and then I also thinned it out with styrene and the idea was if it's not quite as viscous it's much thinner that allows it to soak in to the wood before it sets up that will give me a much better bond when I start laminating the fiberglass. And because this doesn't have any wax in it, I don't have to do any sanding uh, or de-waxing in between coats. It will stay a little bit tacky though. It doesn't get perfectly hard, but that's fine. I will add wax to the resin when I do the last coat, when I have all the fiberglass cloth in place. With the two applications I put on it, the first one just soaked right into the wood right away. The second one took only about half as much resin uh, to put on a coat. And there were a few stabbed areas I noticed. And I just applied it a little bit heavier. I went back over it a couple of times with more resin in spots. But for the most part, it looks like I'm going to have a very good cohesive bond. And I shouldn't have any problems with delamination. Next step, I'll start fiberglassing. And the first part of the fiberglassing job will be to apply the fiberglass tape all around the, the joints, so along the chine and around the transom and the stem. Thanks for watching. Drunken sailor, what shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor?